Vinny and Abby. Hello. Hello. Check uh, out Kiryu. Look at this guy. He Alex, looks exactly the same. I've yep. seen this guy before. Yes, you have. You might have even seen him in this game before because this is Yakuza. Oh, you just shove that guy. <laughs> yeah, I'm just going to shove everyone around. Uh, this is Yakuza 3. Uh, this is not a new Yakuza game. This is an HD update of an existing Yakuza game. So the, we, yeah. Sorry, go, go, sorry ahead. go ahead. Well, so we are here going to look at the collection, right? Yes. So this is the Yakuza Remastered Collection. It includes uh, Yakuza 3, 4, and 5. Uh, all of which which have not gotten the Kiwami treatment, which is to say like a full like remake treatment. Uh -huh. This is an upscaling of an existing game. They've turned the dials. Yes, they have turned the dials. Uh, they have made them the, the assets look nicer. Uh, and that's really kind of what these games are. And I just kind of wanted to show off a little of each one for folks who might be interested in checking out this package. So you can get 3, 4, and 5 currently on the PS4 50 or 60 bucks yes and then each 60 one 60 bucks for the total for all three for all three and then each one individually yeah. if you just want to buy one piecemeal i think are 25 dollars each okay that's okay so i get, appreciate that you can do a piecemeal yeah and you get a little discount if you if you buy them all together uh, uh would you say i mean we'll, we'll go through a bit of all yeah. of these uh mostly it's the aesthetics right yeah pretty uh, much it's, it's it's a visual upgrade they have not really changed any of the systems of the games uh they still use the old save systems where you have to find like phone booths and stuff like yeah, that and it's mm. the same fighting engine and all yeah that. it's the same fighting engine so if you have already played through these games uh there isn't really going to be anything like new content wise here for you but uh <laughs> You know, I haven't played these, so I, would, I I actually welcome the fact that there now I have every single mainline Yakuza game on one console that I can just play. So yeah, that's a great point to bring up. Let's just get this out of the way. Currently, if you want to start in the Yakuza franchise, yes, you would. Uh, um, I yeah. guess one could start with uh, Kiwami. Yes. Oh. Well, you can start with zero. Start with zero. Yeah. Sorry, and then go into Kiwami, which is one. Yes. Which is a totally. Remade. It is a remake of the original Yakuza game. Uh, in the okay, I won't get too in the weeds here, but it's with the six engine. Five. Uh, this is this. All yeah. right, here it is. This, yeah. It's good that I we're spelling it. all this okay. out. So Kiwami One uses the Yakuza Zero engine. Yakuza Zero engine. Okay. And then Kiwami Two, which is a remake of Yakuza Two, yeah. uses the Yakuza Six engine, which was new for Yakuza Six. Which was new for Yakuza Six. Yes. Uh, and then after that, after Kiwami Two, then you've got this. Um, turn the dials up on three, four, and five yes. on the Yakuza collection, which are just um, nicer, prettier looking versions of the original game. And then you have a fresh game in Yakuza 6. Yes, and all of these things and that are is, correct. that is the end yeah. of the, currently the end of the series. Yes. Okay, all on the PS4, right just in time for the PS5. Yes. Okay. So we're 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 in the pretty early goings of all these games, I will say. So you will not be seeing any major spoilers here. Uh, okay. I did play a little past the intro in all of them because some of these have very long intros, sure, uh, where you don't do a whole lot. So in Yakuza Three, uh, the beginning of the game has uh, Kiryu and and Haruka getting ready to move to Okinawa, okay, uh, which is I believe where they are going to go uh, run their orphanage. Okay, um, so this is him saying goodbye to the folks in Kamarocho. Did the other ones have voice acting? I forget. Uh, they do, and th this game does have voice acting. It's just that not all the scenes have it. Gotcha. The earlier games had less in the like side scenes as opposed to like just like the main cutscenes. Hmm. It, it was six, the first one to have full or, or I think all that was the first one that had all the sub stories had voice acting. Okay. Yes, which is also why there were fewer sub stories in that game. Gotcha. Um, so we got to go find uh, Majima before we leave. Have you played all the Yakuza games? I've played a little of all of them. I have not okay. played through all of them because they are very long, and I've also not really had much time to catch up on my own. Gotcha. So I've played through all of Zero with, with our friend Vinny here and, and Dan, uh, and I, I played remember. through all of Six, but I have not played that? through the entirety of all the rest of them. That guy was smoking in a hospital. Yeah, it was a different time. Oh, my goodness. Here's what else, yeah. That's, it, it was good for your health back then. Wow. Yeah. The world's changed. Science is a hell of a thing. You're telling me, Vinny. <laughs> when are they going to make a game about science? Never. Cool. All right, let's go find Majima. Too risky. <laughs> and then we'll load up Yakuza 4. Too hot Gamers button. Gamers aren't ready for it. No. Ugh. What is the current state of Majima? Uh, he's around. He's doing is he stuff. Up, is he? Uh, is he in? Is he out? Is he? Is he part of a? Crime he's kind of doing his own thing. He's got Majima Construction going. Okay. Still. 
yes, still. Hmm. Does this one have goofy games? Uh, I think Can they you they go all to like a, an OnlyFans type of chat room. Uh, I don't believe this one has the porno chat. Okay. What is their porno chat equivalent? Uh, I don't know. I haven't played deep enough in okay. to How know horny all the things. is this game? Oh, they're all horny. They're all a little horny. Like a cocky, punk? cocky punk. Which one's the cocky punk? They're all. Why do they keep blooping in that one spot? Because there's uh in these old games <laughs> they had a thing where like if you if an NPC walks into oh. a cutscene they have a, a routine where they have to <laughs> run away but sometimes it's a little awkward. Oh. Fascinating. Hi. Look at that cocky. He's mad because I beat up his friend earlier. Oh, cocky punk and imposing punk. I want to be a cocky punk. I am not shitting myself because that sweater is like the least threatening thing <laughs> in the world. It's CM punk. Whoa, look at that dude's proportions. The jacket guy with the jeans? Yeah. I mean, it was. His head's too small. It was the mid aughts. There was a baggy clothes were very yeah. much the thing. What a look. Looks like Billie Eilish. And these are bad guys. Good one. I know oh. what the kids are into these days. <laughs> My mom loves Billie Eilish. Really? Yeah. I have nothing against Billie Eilish. No, I just yeah, uh, she seems I hope I hope she's doing okay. Seems to be hard when you get real successful real young. Yeah. Billie Eilish is the one whose mom is the voice of Samara. Yes, that's correct. Wait, what? Very cool. Her Samara? her mother is an actress in uh, Mass Effect. What? Yep. Ugh, the nepotism in Hollywood. It's too much. Not too much. All right, they're can't gonna try escape it. No, just like, apparently. just like here, you can't escape dumbasses yeah, yeah. trying to fight him on the street. Let's see what this fighting engine is like. This is probably the weakest of the three as far as like the fighting goes. All right, big cell. Here. All right, so I gotta, <laughs> I'm, I'm guarding right now. Come on, attack me. Come on, dude. It's okay. Be building up a meter when the, you block him. Uh, you I'm just doing meter? like tutorial stuff here. Like oh, I said, I, this I is see. pretty early on. Okay. Come on, attack me one more time. Okay. Whoa, good block. Yeah. Man, right. that businessman is so excited to see this happen. Yeah, he's, and he's got some pretty good ups. I he, know. He can jump pretty high. the bag and everything. Yeah, there's, there's, another, uh, there's another person over to the left who's trying to uh, get up there with him, but yeah. can't, play, can't no. quite reach. <laughs> dude should play basketball. Whoa, check Quick out stepping. that move. Yeah. Wow. He got like Keelys on. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Dragging a Dojima. He knows how to move around. Yeah, right. apparently. All right, now let's just beat these guys' ass. Oh, come on. Come here. Yeah, there we go. Dropkick. It's an old favorite. Who doesn't love dropkick from dudes? Uh, how's the environmental stuff? It's, I mean, those moves are, are weaker in the older games. Like, they're not as elaborate as some of the heat actions get in, okay. the, in the later ones, but they're not bad. And by Ooh, later wait, ones, you mean the, the prequels? It, it, the prequels <laughs> and, and the later sequels, gets yes. pretty gets uh, pretty uh, confusing pretty quickly. Yeah, there's a lot There's a lot going on. Um, do you think they'll ever, fi like, how finished is each story? You Very. know what I mean? Okay. Yeah, so it's I mean, more just like same characters, different events. Yeah, I mean, they revisit some story stuff. Like there is an ongoing plot in these games, but like it's kind of like Toy Story. Yeah, but they, <laughs> they, they, yes, it's exactly like Toy Story. Uh, Kiryu is is Woody. Oh man, you know, I saw the latest Toy Story. Yeah, I haven't Woody... seen it. Yet. Yeah, no spoilers. Okay, first. all I'll say is Woody was a freaking wet blanket the whole time. Wet blanket. Yeah, every Woody... other character was more interesting than Woody. Woody can be kind of a wet blanket. He was cool in the other movies. <laughs> Not so imposing, punk. He had a bit of an attitude, I feel like, in, a, in three. Yeah. When he got cocky, remember when he's like, "I'm the good toy." <laughs> oh. I mean, who wants to play with a cowboy doll, really? Me. Uh, the best Woody. Story was it Toy Story four, right? His latest yeah. yeah. Toy Story four should just be Woody at like antiques roadshow. <laughs> <laughs> That's basically like, what Toy Story two was. Yeah. Just uh. Wait, oh, I was thinking Toy Story 2 was 3 then. No, 3 is when mm -hmm. they go to the pl the the daycare. Yeah. Okay, 2 is when the collector gets mm -hmm. him. I like 2. 2 that's is when the best. Had, that's two when he like had the attitude. Peak Pixar yeah. in I my think 3 opinion. is the best personally. Oh, no, you're wrong. 3 is the Three has the what like the ending that is like just emotionally wrenching, or at least the one I mm -hmm. found most emotionally mm -hmm. wrenching. Yeah, I don't always love the Pixar like cry movies. Fair enough. I mean, um, I'm kind of done with Pixar, I feel like, for the most part, but... I like them. I'm not as, like, I gotta see every movie as yeah. I used to be. Uh, anyway, what? Toy Story 4 is pretty funny. Forky's a great character. Who? Forky. Oh. He's, He's trash. Fork. He literally is trash. He's trash. Is it a toy? 
kind of. Okay. Well, listen, all trash can be a toy if you, uh, if exactly. you're creative enough. Boy, that must really hit uh, hit uh, Woody's ego, though. <laughs> <laughs> Kid wants to play with his trash instead of me. <laughs> Man, Vinny, it's like you've seen it. Uh, toy Story 5 should just be... Uh, uh, the dog chewing on Woody <laughs> as a, as kids play Fortnite. That's basically <laughs> Toy Story One, Vinny. Uh, no. Nah, Remember guys, Sid? Yeah, but that's like still like kids yeah. play with toys. <laughs> Toy Story Five should just be they're all playing Fortnite. <laughs> they don't know what discs are. No, they don't know what how to even how to use a stuffed toy. All right, we now know where Majima is, and oh, now they're all haircut. bowing to me because they know who I am now. Wow. You I'm the fourth kick chairman. Their asses for them to respect you. Pretty much. Whoa. <laughs> Somebody must have just got out. Three people, uh, kids looking for the, the QR code on Woody's butt to scan it <laughs> so they can play with it in the game, <laughs> in Disney Infinity or something. I don't get how this toy works. There's the upgrades I'm for this I'm supposed to use my hands? It's like a baby's toy. <laughs> Is this how your kids interact with the world? <laughs> kind of. <laughs> Skylanders was a bad thing. Sorry, this game. Yes, this game. We're about to go find Majima. Okay. Does this have the goofy humor like we know from the Yakuza game? Yeah, I think pretty much all the ones from like two on have at least some version of that. Like it's, it, it isn't always as refined, but I feel like there's at least some wacky shit happening in all these games. I also feel like uh, the Yakuza games have, uh, and sorry if it's just kind of this is a very surface level skip through the yes, Yakuza stuff, not the way to <laughs> digest them no. three at a time in yeah. a uh, twenty minutes a piece. It's it's hard. You have to get invested. <laughs> yes, uh, and sometimes they are slow burns. Yeah, like five game. in particular has a very long intro that kind of takes a while to get going. Like there's some interesting story stuff in there, but like you kind of have to sit through it before yeah. you really kind of mm. get to the meat of what's happening. Yeah. Yeah, and I, I should. Before, I know people might be upset that we're not doing a full story-based quick look of each thing, but the, the purpose of this is more the... Yeah, this is just to kind of show you like what these games look like in their their yeah. new form. Does and they, it feel good? Yeah. I mean, again, the, the the engine itself, like some of these games are, are a little more aged than, than the current Yakuza, Yakuza games feels like, but like they're still fun. It looks like an up yes, older game or yeah. a lower budget modern game. Yeah, <laughs> agreed. You know? Yes, exactly. Here we are on the rooftop. Mm-hmm. Looking good. Look at that voice. I, I hear you're balling. Mm-hmm. I am a baller. Do they have the same voice actor for all the games? Uh, yes, it is. The same Kiryu voice actor, same Majima voice. Most of the main characters are the same voice actor. Throughout the actors, whole throughout thing? The, I think throughout the whole thing, yeah. It's a, run. it's a real Nancy Drew situation, if you know what I mean. Uh, if you're, if you're uh, watching this and, and notice that we might have been missing some audio cues earlier on, we did change a setting. It was uh, in the PlayStation yeah, side. Yeah, cutscene. Yeah, right before this. Someone was using our PS4 and changed some stuff. Mm. Switch again for sharing your toys. Yep. Never again. Woody wouldn't do it. Mm -mm. No way. <laughs> Don't share toys. Woody's the most selfish man alive. <laughs> he learned about friendship and then learned about looking out for himself. Yeah. You get one snake in your boot, it changes a man. You've got a friend in me. I don't think so. No. <laughs> looking out for number one. <laughs> <laughs> um, you got a friend of me that's Randy Newman, right? Randy Newman. I believe that is Randy Newman, yes. Have you all listened to his other music? Oh, he's got some It is yeah. way different than you've got a friend of me. I love that he, that's what he's so famous for. Uh, uh, for I mean, all Randy I've, Newman music at least has sound like Randy Newman. There's but. I feel like there's three things Randy Newman is famous for, and I don't okay. mean to really just go tangential on this whole <laughs> thing, but like, one, Toy Story. Yes. Two, uh, this is, I, I, that's I my love, generation. That's I love I L.A., and oh, three, I I love LA. short people have no reason to live. What? <laughs> Which is uh, these are two things I have not heard about. I know it's like very political music. Wait, what? <laughs> is that a song? Oh yeah. Huh? <laughs> huh? I don't think I heard that one. Anyway, I'm trying to convince him to uh, to rejoin Tojo to help out Daigo as he takes over as chairman here. And guess what? Majima is not going to want to go easily. Um, I did look up the lyrics uh -huh. for something else. <laughs> <laughs> like, Randy Newman has some thoughts. <laughs> I want to read this. You um, know, as I was saying it, and you said, is that a song? It, de it definitely was like, I'm, I'm not making this up. It's a song. Okay, it's a song. Yeah. Um, 
I can read one quick verse. No, it's okay. Okay, look it up for yourself, folks. <laughs> That's what this fight scene is missing. It's a Randy Newman soundtrack. <laughs> yes, yes. You got yep. a friend. Oh, the you got a back oh. tattoo. I couldn't get through this quick look without at least one shot of them pulling off their shirts. Yeah, wow. Well, back tattoos. So far, I've only seen one uh, shirt pulled off. So. Well, oh, there will be another. Is it a reveal in every game that they always have the same back tattoo? Yeah, yeah, but it's a good shot yeah. every time. It looks cool. Also, his skin is gray. He needs to. He doesn't get out a lot. He looks unwell. He spends a lot of time out at night. There we go. Everybody has tearaway suits. Mm hmm. I mean, they know they're going to have to fight at some point, so it's just useful to have a tearaway suit. Man. Wait. Okay. So I was only like half around when y'all did Beast in the East. Mm -hmm. Are they friends or not? They're frenemies. Okay. Uh, Majima went a little off with you guys. They, like, they are more often aligned than not, but like... Majima is such an unpredictable weirdo that sometimes he just runs afoul of Kiryu. Like, sometimes I get the sense, and I have not. I've osmosisly. Osmosisly? Let's go with that. Uh, that's, picked not up, you, that's not a word, but I uh, like it. I, it feels like, you know, Majima sometimes just wants to fight. I mean, okay. who doesn't? Never been in a physical altercation. With I Majima. Don't, I don't recommend with it. Anyone. It's not fun. Yeah, it doesn't seem fun. I also don't think I do well in it. I mean, there are sports that are, uh, you know, tests of martial prowess. Sure. Yeah. But I mean, I did roller derby for a little bit. Which yeah, that's a that, that was, was physical. physical yeah. Oh my god, yeah. knocking girls down was very fun. But that's different than like getting punched in the face. I can't say that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> I'm not allowed to say that. <laughs> <laughs> Only you and Randy Newman's other song. <laughs> <laughs> it's the fourth one. <laughs> <laughs> I'm surprised they didn't put the Show People song in uh, Toy Story. <laughs> uh, yeah, I think he probably wants to move past that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he's fast and yeah, strong. Yeah, I mean, he's Majima. Yeah. He's also early game Majima, but still. Drop kick him in the face. How about that? He doesn't seem to mind. Uh oh. Oh, you're pow you're powering up. Super finish. Wow. Okie dokie. Feel the heat. What's what's happening? Are you he's, mashing? He's, he's I'm mashing, mashing R2. Okay. Well, this is an interesting mechanic. Yeah. I've not seen this. Uh oh. I think. Oh. oh my goodness. I think three might be the only one that has this specific version of it. Like finishers. No. This this particular kind of finisher. Yeah. Uh, I don't feel like it was a bit anticlimactic. You know Again, the moves are not as elaborate in this one. You know what this reminds me of? What's that? The end of the Quiet Man. Yes. <laughs> That's a shame. Classic rooftop fight. <laughs> the one we all know and love. Oh, that game. Just a uh, stamina up and. What's that bell? I think it's just like an item that they give you at the beginning of the game if you have like a save already. Oh. From like other Yakuza games. Like sometimes they will just give you like item boosts as like a thank you for playing yeah. these games. Oh, so close. I'm just gonna keep trying to drop kick it. Oh, he's gonna keep dodging. He's out the journey, though. It is. I just need to get one or two good more shots in there, but he's not going to be. There we go. Good work. You defeated Majima. I did. Oh. Ah, uh, sleepy. Aw. got big hands. Cool shoes. Oh, my God. I would die for a pair of shoes like those. I, mean, I think you can just buy them. Wow. Yeah. Majima is pretty cool. Yeah. Oh, no, I agree. I mean, he's a total weirdo. He's got an eye patch. Yeah. <laughs> Um, if you had only one working eye, would you wear an eye patch? Uh, yeah. Wow, quick, quick response from Alex. I believe in eye patches. Cool. Like they're, I mean, they're you having. Still wear one. I love that they're having what their postcoidal fucking oh cigarette here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like this is their version of sex. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> 
Uh, does this have well. English uh, oh, voiceover? No, okay. I don't think uh, any. So the only games that have English voice acting are the original Yakuza One, okay, which had no. like Mark Hamill and a bunch of like oh. semi-famous voice actors in it. But the the dub is terrible. Okay. Uh, and is Judgment. Mark Hamill? And Judgment. Okay. So yeah, Majima is Mark Hamill. Oh. And he does a bad job. It's. They, it was the first game, and I feel like the voice direction, the writing is also not as strong in that one, but like the, the voice direction, I feel like, at least for the English, was not great. Looks like somebody's else's, somebody else's hand mm -hmm. putting that cigarette to his mouth. Should we move on to the next Yakuza? Yeah, I'm just going to wait for this scene to close out, and sure. then we're going we're gonna to load up Yakuza 4. Man, making our way through. I don't through. know if y'all can hear that banging. It's oh, just yeah. the building construction. It never ends. Modular construction. Can't <laughs> trust him. Oh, look at that look. <sighs> Where's his shirt? He doesn't need one. Loves a no shirt. What a look. <laughs> yeah, gotta have confidence. Ha, <laughs> So is he is he a big antagonist in this one? I mean, he's a I think he's a major character, but yes. again, I I haven't okay. gotten too far past this point, so I don't know exactly what role he. But I mean, he's helping you in this case. Okay. Yeah. All right. So from here, yes, we're gonna load up Yakuza Four. Okay. Okay. Oh, so it's like totally separate. Uh, Executables. Yes. Wow. Fascinating. We should play Goat Simulator. Mm -hmm. That's the that's the seventh Yakuza. <laughs> also, eighty hours long. And the goat just has a tattoo of a human on its back. <laughs> <laughs> Very scary. Uh, with this one, I'm just gonna load up where my last save was, okay. and we'll we'll just see where we're at. Do they? Uh, I guess we'll find out. But uh, spoilers. Do they all kind of look similar? Yeah, pretty similar. They're all the same engine. I think three is like the chunkiest looking one. Okay. Uh, but four and five, I, at least from what I've seen, look pretty good. These pre-rendered scenes, I think, look look nice. Yeah. Do you know if they look like that in the original? Probably not as good. But I mean, these so these were on PS3. Uh huh. So I mean, there's a little more horsepower going on. I think like one and two were the the PS2 ones. Okay. So which is, I think that's why they got the the full yeah. remake treatment. Yes. Right. So with this one, the first chapter, which I already played through, uh, you play as Akiyama, who, I don't know if you remember him, he's like a loan shark dude. I, I don't remember which games he shows up in and which ones he doesn't, but like, so you spend the first chapter just playing as him. Okay. Uh, and Kiryu hasn't really appeared or anything yet. Is that your character? I think that's Akiyama? This is like judgment. Akiyama does also sort of hang out with this, the city's homeless population. Like, he's very friendly with them. He brings them food and drinks and stuff. Well, that's no good. Oh, yeah, you hate to see that. That shouldn't happen. Oh no, it's like uh, Die Hard. I haven't seen it. Is that the Christmas movie? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> At the end of Die Hard, all the bail bonds, right? Yeah. They start raining down. I don't think that's Akiyama. If you saw this, would you try to get the cash? Uh, yeah. Oh. Like, like, if, what, what are we talking? Like, it's a, like ones or is it like hundreds? There's Akiyama. Fives. Fives? Mm -hmm. Mm, I might run. Really? I might. I might split. I feel, like, I feel like it's gonna be a bad. Scene. I know. I would grab a few, and then I would think I would get out of there. I like I don't think I would there. let myself be one of those people who's like rolling around on the ground, be like. Rah! Yeah. No. 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 I would. I would feel like it would probably get dangerous pretty quickly. And yeah. I just want to get out of there. Oh, okay. This is your character. Yeah. That's right. So he gets arrested in the first chapter because he sees a, witnesses a murder, but the killer runs away, and then the cops think you did it. Okay. Is he a lawyer? Uh, he's a loan shark, okay. but he's like loosely Yakuza affiliated, but not part of any family. He has a pleasant voice. Oh, oh. <laughs> I mean, he's doing a voice yeah. now, but these scenes look good. Yes, they do. 
Like, is he an ex lawyer? It looks like he's got that lawyer pin, uh, like the 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 lawyer badge. It does look like that. I don't really know a lot about Akiyama as a character. I haven't really played the games where like his stuff is established. I feel like there's more of him in this game maybe than than in other ones. Okay. I mean, it could just be a medallion. Yeah, all, that's also possible. Not related. Don't, don't stop. Hey. You don't have to keep doing it. I, I get it. Don't feel the crime. The main thing about him is that, like, no one really knows where his money comes from. Mm. And he has like weird rules about how he'll lend money to people to the point where like a lot of people when they buy when they get money from him, they never want to borrow from him again. Oh. But it's not like Right, not violent. It's not like he's doing crazy like interest or anything. Like it just no one really knows why what the deal is. Oh, he's a scout. Menacing. So you have not seen Kiryu yet? Not up to this point in this game, no. Flip phone? Yep. Hannah. Uh, is your receptionist. She's like, she works in your office. Gotcha. The Lone she's Shark also, office? She's also the one who got you out of jail. Cool. That's nice of her. She's mad. Oh, she gives you a lot of shit. Oh, look at that. She's got a point. Jeez. Damn. Beep, beep. Damn. Yeah. He didn't even flip his phone down. He just put the whole thing <laughs> in his pocket. Yeah. <laughs> So here we are, back in, in Kamarocho. Sure, I'd say this look, maybe looks a little better than the last one. Yeah, yeah, I think that, like I said, I think three is the chunkiest looking of them. Uh, four and five, I feel like, even though they are not new engine, oh, what is that they look pretty nice. Which building? The castle, right next to you. Uh, that is Club, Club Castle. Club Kamaro Castle. Man, I want to go back to Japan. Uh, wait, what? <laughs> What's with the face? What's with the uh, they're, they're I, twins? I just have one. A fight? It's okay, I don't know why Man. this guy's fighting me, but People that's fine. Love fighting. Whoa! He's got These friends too. These businessmen are so down to clown. I love it. Wow, they're all getting on the action too. Good kicks. Do you know why you're being attacked? No, okay. I have no idea why these men are mad at me. This is just part of the game of like, hey, have some fun, fight some stuff. <laughs> Here are some idiots. Take like, them up. Take like, up the are there rival loan sharks? Uh, I don't know. That don't guy's know. got a blade. He went, went behind the uh, behind the camera at this point. Oh my goodness! I hope a drink comes out. Damn it! I did just step on that guy's skull though. Yeah, that doesn't seem good. See that guy with the sword with his little like tanto blade? It's uh, no. uh, he keeps on ducking out. Tanto blade. Behind the the. I don't know if I'm using the right. You probably <laughs> aren't. I don't know. This type of knife originally used in feudal Japan. Yeah. Short Check out. Blade. Look what he's got. Look what he's got when you see him. Tell me if I'm right. Where is he? Okay. okay. Right here. This guy. Right here. Yeah. Oh. Oh, we'll oh never my know. Oh my god. You see it? You it see it? You looks see it? Like what? It also yeah. kind of looks like a play knife. <laughs> Pick it up! Oh, that's totally- yeah! Oh, it's, oh, a, it's chip a chip deck. Dagger. Hey, listen. You're close. They had the- Oh, oh my god. 
I just had that man in the stomach. Jesus, you, they, people, these people just witnessed a murder. Yeah. I just liked your face. Oh, I'm fine. He's fine. <laughs> That's enough. Can you call, uh, call a doctor? Oh, my goodness. Oh, shot. Thank, it's thanks. shocking. What was, your, what was your problem, I dude? I just wanted to give you a free sample of this Monster Energy drink. People just cheered you killing <laughs> someone. But no, he was fine. He just gave me a drink. News story of the century. I want to play Pachinko 24-7! Fight me. What's going on over here? Man. Hey, we've been through this park a yeah. lot. Yeah. We've been to all these places a lot. Hmm. These are places you have been, my man. A lot. I think this is where the murder happened. Well, there was another murder Oops. that just happened. <laughs> that guy was fine. He got up. Oh, my God. He just disappeared into the oh. earth. I got a oh. water key. All right. We should probably give that to the lost and found. <gasps> okay. I have a moral dilemma for okay. you guys. I okay. was leaving the subway station. Mm -hmm. And you stabbed a guy in the stomach. Yeah. W w am I in the wrong? <laughs> he said he liked my face. <laughs> <laughs> no, then. No. Um, But there was, uh, like, a dropped reusable, like coffee cup and I almost took it but it was like next to people and I just left it but it was like on the ground would you have used it or thrown it away I would have washed it it was reusable it was like one of those travel mugs yeah and it was one that I had been like shopping for and I was like oh my god <laughs> but it was like kind of next to people and part of me was How like you know I should have dropped, picked it up because so. it was on the ground but like, like tipped over somebody wouldn't have put it there no because it was like on its side so I almost picked it up and was like, hey, is this yours? And then if they said no, I'd walk away with it. But it, that felt weird to me, so I just left it. I don't know if there's an ethical or moral dilemma. Yeah. I, I think I just would have been more like, yuck. It's you wash it. Why did somebody get rid of it? it? You wash it several times. Because they pissed in it? Yeah, exactly. Because they're like, I only use this for my piss. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. That's what I was planning to do with so, it. Some things you can't wash out. Yeah. Okay, yeah, I, I mean, that. I, even junk's junk, right? Get yeah. rid of the trash. Recycle, reuse, no, exactly. reuse, recycle. Reuse, yeah, reuse. Get rid of plastic bags mm. in New York, you already. Light, uh, light. Yes. Man, a lot of smoking indoors. I'm glad that fad is over. Oh, yeah. A lot of people, a lot of smokers in Japan. I, maybe not as many as there used to be, but I feel like even when I was there a few years ago, a lot of people smoking in Japan. But it, I feel like when I was in Japan, you had to go to the little smoking section. Yes, there are definitely like more smoking areas, I think, now than maybe there used to be. But uh, there are de there were definitely a lot of people smoking around like bars and restaurants when I went there. I think the first uh, TGS we did, we hired some um, some really nice guys, local contractors, to help with the production. I just remember going to the room where they were editing in the hotel room, which is full of cigarettes. Really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> wild. Yeah, it was kind of wild. That's fun. <laughs> also, do you have a lighter? <laughs> you don't look suspicious at all. No, definitely not. Hey. <laughs> hey. Where's Hana? Hi. She's not there right now. I think she just left you that food mm. that was cold. Classic Hana. Mm. I don't think I've met this woman yet. I have no idea who she is. She looks distressed. Yeah. I don't think you come oh. to a loan shark unless something's wrong. I hate your face. <gasps> she has eyeballs. Wait. She looks the same. <laughs> Those glasses. Oh, wait, what is that from? Oh, no. uh, was that the thing in his drawer? Yeah. Yeah. This is a no smoking yeah. room. Uh, Can't you see this pile of ashtrays? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wow, pink cigarettes cool. Not cool, Abby. Yeah, no, smoking's it's not, not cool. cool, but also fucking yeah, cool. Yeah, not bad. That's how they get the kids with the, <laughs> the pink cigarettes. She's got some, like, fucking Virginia Slims. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like an extra length Virginia Slim. <laughs> so, like, 120s or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> She's like, I, uh, I painted this myself. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
I'm inhaling toxic taint. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? And I don't. You gonna say something? <laughs> Explain yourself. What's going on here? Goyushi no ken desu ka? Ah, hai. Sore nan desu ga. Ano. De. Kochira. Ano. Oh my god, lady. Well, limitless is maybe not. <laughs> I mean, hmm. I want all the money. The way a bottomless pit is not actually <laughs> bottomless. I'd like uh, a billion dollars, please. <laughs> I want to buy your company. Internet ad. あなたへの融資を断った同業他社の方にでも聞いたんでしょうから。うちの店は金貸せないけど、あの店なら貸してくれるかもよって。どうせ他にもいろいろ吹き込まれたんでしょう。うちの店は同業の人たちにはあんま
in this closet and smoke this whole pack of cigarettes. <laughs> Teach you a lesson. Yeah. They're going to make her do road construction. <laughs> Just a lot of pregnant pauses in this scene. I mean, Isn't that like yeah, that's the actual yeah, 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 yeah. more I, I feel like even more so than usual. <laughs> so far, it seems pretty on brand. Yeah. <laughs> no, I was fucking with you. <laughs> I just like 10 bucks. はい、そうです。でも、テストに受からなかったら時間の無駄遣いになっちゃうわけなんだけど。どうします。それでもテストの方受けてみますか。<笑><笑> ほんとにいいんですね。皆さん、あのメリンダーラーズ<笑> Don't loan to that woman. Oh, God. <laughs> you know who this is? I think I met him earlier, yes. Does he work for you as well? He's... What is he? I think he's a Yakuza guy. Hmm. Or a cop, one of the two. I don't remember. I I played this last week, and I I just played the opening scene, so I got to remember what the roles are. But he's someone you're friendly with, I think. Okay. This is about the murder thing that I witnessed. Ten days, hundred million yen challenge. <laughs> All right, then. And nothing will terrible will happen to this person, I'm sure. I feel like you really should know what the test is before you Look, buddy, it's a name. Just go with it. <laughs> it's enough to identify a person. Yeah. I love this dopey smile on his face. Oh, lady like me. Oh, what? The, is, he is just punched you? himself in the mouth with his phone. <laughs> that's Cutscenes. Not you, that's not you controlling it? No, okay. that's the game. Hmm. 
I feel like being like, I know how to run my business is mm. never a sign of confidence. Oh, it's a, his assistant. Yeah, yep, there's Hana. I love her pink shoes. What a look. I like her little scarf, too. I know. She's nailing it. It's a powerful look. What is that thing? Like That's a good question. Is that an exercise bike? With no pedals? The, what is that? That's I don't trust It's a good question. This. I don't like it either. Can you use it? I'm gonna as soon as I get control back, that's the first mm -hmm. thing I'm looking at. All right, go what for is it. this? I think explain. what is this? Hana, explain. Maybe you do like uh you do like squats on it. Like you said, you don't need thing. a machine for squats. Oh, uh, listen, it's been so many squats are doing. All right, well, well let me do anything with that. Oh, so that's a shame. it's a very confusing object. I agree with all of you. I want information. I want to leave the hideout now, so I'm gonna do that. Bye. Alex, should we check out the final Yakuza? Number yes, five. I think we will. Actually, the final in this collection. I just want to run down Yakuza the street real quick. Five. Yes, yes. So we will check out Yakuza number five, Blue Vega's hot, <laughs> hottest Yakuza. <laughs> Little bit of Kiria by my side. Yeah. Listen. Little bit of Majima. Yeah, here we go. Yeah. Little bit of Aki. I, I don't know. Hana. That's too many syllables. Little bit of Kaido is what I need. Ah, yeah. We'll just we'll go ahead from here, and we're just gonna load up Yakuza five. Yakuza right five. Now. Here we go. Is it winter older, time? Huh? Everyone's got coats on. I like think you're in the southern part of Japan, at least at the early part of this going, so you're part of this game. Are you Kiryu from the start here? You are Kiryu from the start in this one, though it, there's an interesting uh, intro to this one. Mm. Wow. <gasps> Oh, Sega did this one. I will say that I went and saw the uh, Sonic the Hedgehog movie. It was really funny seeing the giant Sega logo where they have like all the video screens of all the different games and seeing Kiryu in the beginning before a Sonic the Hedgehog movie was very funny. That's pretty cool. Like the, the logo, like the zoom out of the logo has little TV frames with each of their games in them. Oh, kind of like the, like the Marvel Studios. Yes, thing. exactly. Okay. So Kiryu is, uh, is at the front of the Sonic the Hedgehog movie. Uh, yeah, it looks kind of funny. sad. Uh, he's kind he's of in a weird place when this game kicks off. So, like, the the game starts with uh, Daigo, who is the sixth chairman of the Tojo clan, uh, <laughs> meeting up with a another uh, patriarch of another family. Uh, and at a point after the, after that meeting, he gets into a uh, into a car with a mysterious cab driver, and that mysterious cab driver turns out to be Kiryu. Oh, so Kiryu is just kind of in hiding at this point. Like he's working a job as a taxi sure. driver and he's sending money to Haruka who is uh trying to become an idol. That was the little girl in Yes. The, she's the, she's in a like three. she's much older now right. and she is uh trying to pursue a career as an idol. Oh I like his uh little shimmy down the steps. Yep. So are you back in Camarocho now? Uh this is not Camarocho. This is uh I forget which Ooh. neighborhood this is, but uh was I supposed to stay in my apartment? I was probably supposed to stay in my apartment. That's fine. Now you get to shimmy back up the steps. I'll shimmy back up the steps. D oh, is there no, like a paddle in the corner there? What is that thing? What's oh, that? Bottle? Oh, I was drunk. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, I, that's the, hey, you have been drinking alcohol icon. I got into a drunken brawl earlier. Cool. Okay, Seems I probably need to sleep. I think that's what I'm oh, supposed to do Oh, look at your here. tiny fridge. Oh, my goodness. Yeah. Hey, you know. He seems very tall. He's on a taxi mm -hmm. man's salary here, and he's spending a lot of money to his, uh, to his, his, his adoptive daughter. His ward. It feels like a hotel. A lot of apartments in Japan are pretty small. I mean, remember that one in Nancy Drew? Yes. That was a hotel, though, wasn't it? No. Well, oh, yeah, no, right, you're right. The girl's apartment. Yeah. We, I forgot Boomies. we went in there. Oh. A lonely Kiryu, <laughs> alone with his tea kettle. I love making and tea. His, and his cigarettes. Oh, he's got no shirt under his hoodie? Weird. I'm like, yeah, but like people don't. And no socks either. Nobody's in, nobody enjoys wearing anything under the top garment in those games. Yeah. yeah. It's kind of like a metal zipper. It doesn't seem comfortable. <laughs> That's Daigo. Fourth chairman? You are the fourth chairman. Uh. He's the sixth chairman. I forget what happened to the fifth chairman. I, I think that's one of the things that happens in the second game. Trying to melt the handle. I had a head cold. I was trying to get some steam for the sciences. 
Is that your ward? Who's no, that's that? not Haruka. Okay. Is that your wife? I don't know. Does who... he ever have a wife? He's never had a wife. Girlfriend? He's very rarely gotten mixed up with women. He's very, like, chaste in a way, like, very non-sexual, non-romantic. Hmm. Okay, cool. But I think I, I don't really know who that is. I feel like she showed up during some of the early scenes, but that was kind of it. And I don't really remember what that was. They'll never tell you. Yeah. That's the last you see of her. So let's see where this puts us. Okay. A lot of prompts. I think he might be seeing this woman. She's making soup. He slept in his hoodie. Chapter 3. That's what I'm doing. That's what I'm doing. That's Seriously, Kiryu, come on. Wow. あいかあらずつでなしね。まあな。中島さんもあの年で一人。ああ、that's だって左手の薬指にさ、溝あるじゃない。溝うん。あの溝って<笑> you, your boss at the cab company is a nice guy, also kind of an idiot. He got into a couple of drunken brawls the night before including at the hostess club that, that she works at. Uh-oh. I'm presumably she's seen the tattoo before. Yeah, sure comes with the best. That's right, she doesn't know your real name. <laughs> Poor Kiri, you just kind of like, I, I really don't know how to say this more clearly. I kind of just want to be. Yeah. Honest. Unless you're going to start paying rent here. I, this is maybe Harvest not. too small for two. I'm just, yeah. It's just some me time. Keep cooking really. all my broth. <laughs> Turn my tea yeah. off. Don't turn on that picture, by the way. Hi. <laughs> I, live I, here. I, I love you? <laughs> I, li I live here now. Wow. Time to go to work for Nagasu Taxi. Do you actually drive? Uh, I haven't done any driving yet, so I, I, I presume not, but I don't know. Gosh, I'm sure this is one of those things where at the point now, this is... Five? Five. Uh, we actually did a quick look yeah, for this I was here with Austin. Yeah, you remember? Yeah, yeah, so I think I'm at the point now where it's, it is getting weird in a way of like, I, some of this is starting to seem familiar. Yes. And uh, the reason for that being that I'm pretty sure, <laughs> I don't think we played through this part of the game, but yes, we definitely played the opposite five for a quick look years ago. Somebody needed help with one of their exams or something. The, one of the side quests. Jeez. Yeah, I truly don't remember which side quests were in which one. The time is, uh, is is devouring itself at this point. But I think I do remember uh, getting into some fights, mm. like over here by the water, in that quick look. Why did they call you scum? Oh, eh, just it's, uh, people don't like it when you run past them oh. or run into them. 
I feel like he runs kind of like, you know when you have those dreams where you're like trying to run, but you can't yes. go fast enough? That's yes. how he runs. Like he's in mud. Oh. Uh-oh. Well, if there's one theme persistent in all the Yakuza yes. games, it Sleazy is... Sleazy jerks who want to <laughs> fight Kiryu. Uh. Whoa, look at that ponytail! Look at that both? shitty goatee. God. They're oh my god. Wow, yeah, it's bad. It's like drawn on. That's, they both have ponytails. Ooh, ponytail, ponytail thugs. Strap in. Buckle up. Hell yeah. Man. You got some. Throw uh, the hair on the bottom of your chin <laughs> next time, sir. You got some some chocolate around <laughs> your mouth, and I, you might want to wipe that off. Uh, how old? He's probably like fifty here. He's in his forties at you the think? least. What? Yeah, I think so. Because he was what Time in his early twenties in nineteen eighty eight, which is when Zero took place. And when is this? This is like two thousand fifteen. Okay. Oh, wow. So that's like thirty more years. Yeah. So he's probably like fifty. Damn. That's the thing. He is an ageless wonder. <laughs> Time does not matter to him. Well, this these guys. Who's wow, this guy? that is an what outfit. A look. He's a very powerful man. I wonder what that says. That's a cool look. Wrinkle ass. <laughs> oh no, not the Nagasu Devil Killers. <laughs> oh, they're they're offended. Nice hair. Yeah, that dude's whole look is killer. Wants to go to work. Bad attitude. All right, fine. Yes, I'll fight you dumbasses. Blood all over your nice clean work shirt. Uh, oh, that was easy. Devil killer, my ass. Kick him in the nuts. Why is he grabbing his knee? His face got hit. He's very confused. Whoa. Okay, so all the meters and stuff seem pretty similar throughout this run of games. Yeah, I'd say the animations and like the dynamics of the fighting get a little more fleshed out with each one. Are there upgrade trees like in some of the other ones? Ah, that's ah, that's very bad. Ah. That's... Man, that was an easy fight. Yeah. It's embarrassing for those guys. Man, look at that freaking coat. <laughs> With the tiger? Yeah, that thing is so cool. Have you all seen um, Jiro Dreams of Sushi? I have. You know that one guy who like sells them the tuna? Yes. That's him. He should go back to that instead of fighting people. <laughs> Bye, sleazy jerk. Yeah, wonder. I, I'm sure I won't run into them again at all in this game. <laughs> what? What are you mad about? Fight me as well. Ah, uh, yeah. So there's like there's uh, upgrade abilities, skills, all that okay. fun stuff. Uh, so like here's how, what the upgrade tree looks like in this one. Uh, it is, you know, you, you'll you'll go through the progression as you as you play through these games. Okay. But, to see what's up with my boss. And then maybe we'll call this. Coffee boss. But for what it's worth, I mean, I think this is a great way to play these games if you yeah. have never played them before. They're not currently selling any kind of, like, complete package with all of them. Not that I've seen, but I wouldn't be surprised if they do that somewhere down the road, like the full Kiryu collection. Yeah. Um, I mean, there are a bunch of games that only came out in Japan, but those are, like, the side ones, the ones that take place in, like, Feudal Japan and, in, like, the zombie one and all that stuff. Uh, so, but if you just want to play the Yakuza ass Yakuza games, they're all out on PS4 now. You can yeah. get them. It'll cost you a little bit. Yeah. But, th but this seems like a good way to get through. Yeah, three and of them. 60 bucks for three games that are all pretty fully featured, I think, is, is still a pretty good deal all around. The game, there was one available on PS Plus not that long ago, right? Was uh, it, it Kiwami? Hmm. Maybe so. so. I, I could be misremembering. Yeah, Kiwami and Kiwami 2, uh, 0, 6. And then this package, like you can get them all, you can play them all. It's great. I uh, I recommend doing that. If uh, but though at this point, I imagine if you're going to uh, if you've are, if you're looking at this quick look, you've probably already started playing some of these games. Maybe if or, this is your or, first introduction to any of this or series, or you were like, this is too much. I'm just getting into judgment. Yeah, uh, I'll I'll do judgment. 
Uh, yeah, if you have an extra uh, 672 hours to burn. Yes, which uh, I don't, unfortunately. <laughs> but as soon as I do, I am going to play through the rest of these. Uh, these they look good. Yeah. They look good. I think these are these are sharp updates, and again, not as fully featured as the Kwame stuff, but, you know, it's a, a great way to play these games. 60 bucks, three games, PS4. Uh, I don't know if they're going to do PC versions, but they have done PC versions of some of the other games, mm -hmm. so uh, they may down the road. All right. Thanks, Alex. Thank you.